Buli lunaku lwa njawulo wana wakati zuka saa 10 ne muze nyini Chono kola enkira okitegeta kagulu Kati nze nina program nze mili moja na aba waka na bibali Kati abana ku sawa 10 ne tuino gena kuboa Wenso nga jetuari tujia mazidi jenso. Ga, mgo waka lida. Kubanga tuvo ino kukama, netu, netu kama mata kati abazo kuduwa nyamba ko, kusika kayana, kuteka teka kama, kati ya mata kana goku machaba gatuwala. Bangkorela korela kevi ya waka kubanga mbaga banyamu emili mungo yeroruja, guyo zebintu, guyo saka oonga, nzi nongo sako mnyumba, kabiba fumbi la kachai, katiba gendo kumale jojo nene emili muno kuna wanga nae kachai mazo katavula, nga banyu wako, anga baga enda kusomi. Amanya gang and then Sanji Recho, Sebu Fukanga Sebu Fiamami Wang, Lakera Kurimera Kata Round Yawkana Kobone Baganda Kosomero, I was in Kata Kum Kumbiang and Enda Munimi on Nima. Nemo ni mwe bimuru si tuvera mu kokola bilala no tambwa no genda anga butu ina bo business business obulala no tambula kono ogenda mwe bi Kubanga ni nakali tunsi Ni awanse ni ne bidiba bi bi nyanja Omuli mu singo kunko ya kale kwandi badde kulima Nayenga wadu wa mwini mwate gwenko la tegwe gwenko yeza, nayenga wadu wa ujien singo kufuna mwini. Entezi nyo zivade singo kunda bide nga mfuna mwa sente za mata. Nayeka techale tobuzibu entezi singa kuchalo za hafa. Tepa chatu wala luwa guguro, batu wala kumachalo uka. Mwini nga mata aga singa, ni wabana ni bata abuwe bafa kusomero. Nwa bagama ni bata ambuza kunurusi bafa yunga buzibi. Baga ndo kuta ambuza kungo bude buzibi ya tiniji bata ambuza urusi baku liaza amanyiza, urusi baku zebatia. Chia chizibu chatulina icha mata. Tuina chizibu cha amata wanu. Ogo kuta ambuza amata, hatu gadibie, gawa kakumeza uo, bo uruso ugabie magabe, uruso kwa zote abuwe vitio. Mechuche chizibu cha encha alaba mburu unzine, binebio kulima. Na yenge la tulima, katechirunje mwanyi, tulima uvu mwanyi wafene, tutuunda katibu wafunye kakabei. Mwurimu, kumpa hilo vudo vunji. Tegumpa vuzibu. Kumpa hilo vudo vunji, kubangu wagala. Uwe mwurimu guente. Kuvira mwezija, akasente. Wado musana guwa kanaida wafona yu. Echitali kumuanyi, kumuanyi, za nubobo zilo ngo sezo otia, kumusana nga guzize. Zile diyaba wati wati aziziba. Na ye kubisele yu musana ente, mbobo wado kamalita kumi, zesa lako, nubo kamalita mkaga, nusigaye langa wafona kache. Nakasente. Mbia mata gana goku machaba gatuwala. Agoro guru gano giga gana. Ntuageza hako ni ntuga iya. Ntuga suzako wawewe. Ero gatuwala anga baga guba. Ntuga gaba mwaba ulu sudo gawunya. Ntuga ama tuga fumbe. Bo mwanyubo waga fumba tiga vako ulu uvi. Naboni vako. Eh. Nebitule mele ilakati. Mwena fune echi. Eh. Habi ntubi achuka.
the way it works is that it has two components. The first component we call thermization and the second component we, have, we call evaporative cooling. These two are combined to, 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 to create what we brand as evacooler or the evacooling process. Now, the thermization process is, uh, involves putting a small amount of heat into the mill, small enough or high enough to kill the majority of uh, spoilage organism, organisms and small enough not to pasteurize the milk. Now, soon after we've, we've, we've done thermization, the whole can of milk is uh, taken and put into the evaporative cooler so that the temperature drops about 10 degrees below room temperature. With this process, we deliver milk that still has those milk freshness components. The energy component on how it comes in is that the thermization involves, can be powered by biogas, and typically biogas is found on a farm where you're gonna find uh, cows. Now, but you could use other sources, sources of energy since it's the heat energy that is required. The second component, as you probably have seen, is that it involves the fan, a fan sucking air or water that vaporizes, cooling it down. Another way of thinking about it is like this. I don't know if you've ever had an experience where you jump out of a swimming pool on a windy day and you feel cold. What is happening there is the same thing as happening in the evaporative cooling. Those, th that water that is coming off of your skin needs energy and you supply the energy. In the uh, uh, evaporative cooling, it's the milk that supplies the energy and therefore the temperature of the milk, uh, milk drops. My name is Edson Sempira. I'm a research and development engineer at Smallholder Fortunes. Uh, my work has been mainly to look at quality of milk that comes out of the evacuola. We've looked at quality in terms of uh, number of bacteria and also looked at protein and fat. We found out that milk that comes out of the evacuola is actually as good as fresh milk. So we know with this technology in the hands of the farmers, the farmers get to put out better quality milk at the collection centers. And because they can preserve the evening milk, they get to put out more quantities at collection centers and subsequently more quantities in the cold chain. So with more quantities, farmers get to earn more money. Katina go to Bulo, Nagoba Gatwa and Gatwadi Ramune to Gatunda, and to get up on a Yingizaya Fe, Kuangera Gabonora, and goes on Ganga Boga to Japuna, Bolaco, the Kalava Katunsu and Gatukura, the Kanga Saint, as it is in Funeri, Gentunda, Mata, Nongo Sakari Tunsu and Koreo Yang, and I didn't call out Koreonga, Buntu Toto, no, Nekat Nayonga Katibinji, Nawaka, and Yin and Bela Chuka, Nava and Ranga Bengaman to Bagans, the Kusovana, Bakomo, Jabala, and Engi Javafana, and Mukanga and Bela Yakolachi, Yachuka, Kuanga Yingizayo Mutu. Alongo di mabuli ntono na yeka so kola chika so funa echintu echiku echo jamu se orobo jakola chiku banga tu gata gata no di ma no kola kabi zinesi no kono runda no kola chino katiba na bona bogena no gata gata sent orobo funa eva kura ebirungi biendi na biendi dada kubanga ngodi yako kute de kamata bobo di na emere katugeze muogo nga omusimi tu yaga de kumuli ina kumara u. Osoro kumu teleka mu amara mu wiki sibiri, enya anya wiki sibiri. Bobo ni na fruit singa miyembe ma papa liwa kedo toyaga la biengere mangu, obiteka mu firi jeyo. Bibera mu ngabi engere ampola ampola, tebi papa. Kali eicho na chetu acho engere kumata. Kati ati eicho na chetu azura nti ne mu business endale zebio kunywa, nga soda amazi juisi. It also will a business, say you know, a saint. Catchy is so calm, and take a ice and the Eva Kuli, Nimbanga Tins, I don't want to work
My work revolves around quantifying and evaluating the other impacts that come with adopting the Eva Cooler. These impacts include the health impacts and the environmental impacts. On the side of the health impacts, our results have showed that there is a difference in terms of health and especially with the respiratory diseases between farmers that have adopted the Eva Cooler and or are using biogas when compared to farmers that are still using the non-efficient wood biomass energy sources. For the environmental impacts, um, the current practice in Uganda by smallholder farmers is that they pile their dung from the animals somewhere and then use it as fertilizer uh, in their gardens. Um, so what the Eva Cooler does is that we use this dung to make biogas because you need it as a source and in the process we break the harsh greenhouse gases down into simpler gases that are less polluting to the environment. Innovation is twofold with the Eva Cooler. The first part of the innovation, you know, is immunization process. You know, thermization is not new. It's practiced in Europe, Europe and North America on large dairies. And what we've done is scaling it down to be used by a smallholder farmer in that environment with a small amount of milk to be used repeatedly and sustainably without any sophisticated controls. Now, the second part of the innovation is that we've actually coupled thermization and evaporative cooling seamlessly. Please join us. Find your place in this story of surviving to thriving that empowers smallholder farmers everywhere with sub-stories of poverty alleviation, uh, wellness building, and planet sustaining. Thank you for your attention.